Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today we have an exciting topic, the Detroit Lions and their incredible win at home during Monday Night Football against the Las Vegas Raiders. This victory shows that they're back on track, proving themselves to be a top team, not only in the NFC, but in the entire NFL, with the bye week coming up. They have momentum and a chance to get some of their players back to full health. Can you believe it? The Detroit Lions now have a record of six wins and two losses. What an achievement. Now, I know some of you might have watched the Ravens game tonight, but I want to make sure you don't get the wrong idea from the final score. The Detroit Lions completely controlled the game in every aspect, despite a few small mistakes here and there. Yes, there was that interception by Jared Goff that led to a touchdown for the other team, and they could have done better in the red zone. There were also three turnovers during the game. These are areas they need to work on, but at the end of the day, a win is a win. And let's not forget, the Detroit Lions are now six wins to two losses, which is amazing as we reach the midpoint of the regular season. In terms of controlling the game, the Lions did an outstanding job. They held onto the ball for most of the game and were very efficient on third downs, both offensively and defensively. Their running game was imposing, and while Jared Goff had a bit of a mixed performance, he still put up solid numbers overall. We'll delve into that a bit more later. But what stood out was how the Lions played in the second half of the game. This is becoming a trend for them. They take a lead in the first half and then really dominate in the second. They were only ahead by nine points at halftime tonight, but they were the better team right from the start. Before we continue, I want to take a moment to remind you all to hit that like button and subscribe for more daily NFL content. To all the Lions fans out there, know that we love and appreciate your support, and if we could get this video to 100 likes, that would be fantastic. Now, let's talk about the Lions' defense. They were simply incredible tonight, delivering a masterclass performance. We'll discuss specific players like Elon McNeil, Kirby Joseph, and Brian Branch later on. But overall, the defensive unit was solid. Yes, Jared Goff had around 200 passing yards by halftime, but the team's strategy shifted as they continued to dominate. They were strong in the trenches, effective in their passing game, and outstanding in their running game, even without David Montgomery. Jameer Gibbs was a standout player, rushing for over 150 yards. Craig Reynolds also stepped up, nearly reaching 100 rushing yards himself. This team has a lot of depth, and the players complement each other well, creating a strong and cohesive unit. As we approach the trade deadline, which is just 12 hours away at the time of this recording, I don't think the Lions will make any major moves. They might consider adding a cornerback, but overall, the team is in a great place. They have a strong pass rush, led by Aiden Hutchinson, and the defensive line has been performing exceptionally well. Players like Ayla McNeil and Kirby Joseph have been making significant impacts, showcasing their skills and contributing to the team's success. Offensively, the Lions also had a strong performance, despite only scoring 26 points. They racked up 486 total yards, showcasing their ability to move the ball effectively. While there are areas to improve, such as reducing turnovers and increasing red zone efficiency, the team's overall performance was impressive. The defense held the Raiders to just 157 total yards, and Jimmy Garoppolo, the Raiders' quarterback, was limited to only 126 passing yards and an interception. In terms of individual performances, Amon Ray St. Brown had a record-breaking night with 25 receptions over the last two games. Jameer Gibbs showcased his versatility, contributing both in the run game and the passing game. The Lions' rushing unit, which includes David Montgomery, Jameer Gibbs, and Craig Reynolds, is proving to be one of the best in the NFL. Rookie Sam Laporta also had a standout performance with eight catches for 57 yards and a touchdown. He is quickly establishing himself as one of the top tight ends in the league. The team's depth and ability to play complementary football are key factors in their success. To wrap things up, the Detroit Lions' victory tonight was a significant achievement, showcasing their strength on both sides of the ball. While there are areas to improve, the team's performance was impressive, and they head into the bye week with strong momentum. Thank you all for watching, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more NFL content. We'll have another Lions video for you in the next few days. In the meantime, share your thoughts on tonight's game in the comments below.